Every beginning must have an end. But what about our universe? Will it keep expanding forever, collapse into nothingness, or tear itself apart? Surprisingly, the answers might already be hidden inside the language of the universe. Mathematics. Today let's explore how equations and numbers might predict the ultimate fate of everything we know. In 1929 Edwin Hubble discovered that galaxies are moving away from us. His observations proved the universe is expanding, like a balloon being inflated. But here's the key, math allowed scientists to measure this expansion. It's called Hubble's Law. This simple equation shows, the farther away a galaxy is, the faster it moves. But if we can calculate how fast it's expanding, maybe we can also calculate how it might end. This simple equation shows, the farther away a galaxy is, the faster it moves. But if we can calculate how fast it's expanding, maybe we can also calculate how it might end. If expansion keeps accelerating, stars will burn out, galaxies will drift apart, and the universe will grow colder and darker. This is called the heat death, where entropy, the measure of disorder, reaches its maximum. In math, entropy always increases. That's the second law of thermodynamics. But what if gravity eventually wins? Then the universe could stop expanding and collapse back in on itself, like a movie played in reverse. This doomsday scenario is called the Big Crunch. Einstein's equations of general relativity allow for this possibility. There's also a terrifying possibility, the Big Rip. If something called dark energy grows stronger over time, expansion won't just separate galaxies. It will tear apart stars, planets, atoms, and finally space-time itself. All predicted by a single mathematical factor, the equation of state parameter, W. If W are 1, the Big Rip becomes unavoidable. Here's the fascinating part. Each of these endings, Big Freeze, Big Crunch, Big Rip, is not science fiction. They're mathematical outcomes of the same equations, but with different values. The fate of the universe depends on how fast dark energy is pushing, how much matter exists, and the exact curvature of space-time. In other words, math doesn't just describe what's happening right now, it paints possible futures billions of years ahead. But don't panic. Even in the scariest models, the end of the universe is trillions of years away, long after our sun, earth, and even galaxies as we know them are gone. For us, math is not just predicting doom, it's giving us a chance to understand our place in the cosmos. So, can math predict the end of the universe? The truth is yes, it can predict many possible endings. But which one will happen depends on mysteries we still haven't solved. Dark energy, gravity, entropy, numbers that hold the key to everything. Until then, the universe continues its grand equation.